Yo, welcome back. Let's work on our inner stars. How is my nemesis? Speaking of a nemesis, they should really make a remake of Nemesis. I think I'm hoping that they will. Because, yo, it was such a great game. I think uh, Resident Evil Nemesis, Resident Evil 3 Nemesis, was my, uh, my first Resident Evil beat or win. Um, the others were a little more difficult and they did take me a little bit longer down the road to uh, to actually complete them but you know it is what it is and stars I mean who doesn't who isn't a star we're all stars if you think about it we all are unique and there is no one else like us we're basically a star um, aside from us be actually being stardust we are all stars and we should all love our inner stars which this uh, photograph that I took was perfect for this image um, I just <laughs> was walking down the beach and I guess someone put all these shells together and and because uh, I didn't do that I would have probably made it a little bit different it probably wouldn't have been this cool looking but I took a bunch of pictures of it and I ended up picking this one it was um I don't know the, the little dark wave I don't know if you can see them but they're dark waves oh I know I'm talking at like earlier on you probably won't be able to see it until like the end but there are um these like little I don't know there was some discoloration in the sand like some dark um sands or like something uh it's not it's not like it's wet or anything it's it's actually like dark sand and i don't know what creates this i should actually do some research on it i'm actually curious now yeah i'll, I'll uh i'll definitely figure out why it, the sand does this sometimes but when i was walking you know, there's like so many different sections of just the sand where it's crazy dark uh, and this was actually kind of lightish I, I ended up uh well this specific spot was a little little light it's, you can still kind of see like the streaks anyways it looks like flames like black flames if you look at it, underneath the uh the seashell part and um yeah i ended up wanting to make a starfish originally i was just gonna make like a monster um if you look at the uh, title of the the very top on the top left corner of photoshop i had originally named it monster i was just i don't know i just didn't really think of anything specific and then it ended up kind of shaping into a star and i was like hmm you know what this is actually perfect timing because we all had to love our inner star and when I was doodling this particular piece, I was watching, listening to um, you. That's right. You already guessed it. Pitticus lore, um, the hidden enemy or enemy with within in it. I don't know. It was the one of the uh, lost files, hidden enemy with um, the story of number five. Anyways, um, if you haven't checked out Pitika's Lore, O-M-G, oh my god, these series are freaking incredible, like, I am completely, utterly fan of everything that this Pitika's Lore, or the, I don't actually think he's, has he made anything else? I don't know. But I'm just wrapped up and I still haven't finished everything and I'm trying to take my time because I don't want to finish it completely like I don't think the series is completely over I just want to take my time because it like these <laughs> his work man oh my goodness it's it's so good it's incredible I, I kind of want to do like a like a fan doodle I don't know maybe just a fan art I still haven't done a freaking fan art I know I'm disappointing everybody I'm sorry I'm disappointing myself as well but I'll definitely start doing some some fan art I think maybe coming up well yeah definitely this coming up month 
since we are well today I'm, as i'm recording this broadcast it is now the 23rd and but i'll probably pump this out on wednesday 20 yet yeah, tomorrow if i can get done with it um i mean the, the videos for this channel is once a week and still relatively small i don't think it really matters at this point what time or when um to release but i do enjoy putting the uh i guess the images on insta it's kind of cool um again i mean it's still baby infant channel um here and on and basically everything <laughs> uh even the the twitch uh but the twitch i ended up just doing um i'm just gonna do like i guess video games um i did a doodle but i don't wanna like i enjoy recording and and talking i guess to myself because nobody really watches me on twitch um but it's uh when i'm doodling you know later on down the road i'm just thinking you know like i don't really have a following or anything right now i'm thinking more of like the future um man i'm kind of just you know just i'm just doing me man i'm just doing me is that too much to ask for no it's not anyways <laughs> um yeah i'm just thinking that well if i pump out, or if i do the recording on twitch then and then use that same footage or some of the footage maybe do a little bit extra like an external camera for the youtubes it's not uh i mean i don't mind people looking at it live and that would actually be pretty cool but it kind of it's it's like a preview of a preview if that makes any sense i just don't want to put something out where what if i don't like it at the end you know i don't know maybe i'm just overthinking it maybe i shouldn't even think and just do i think we should all just not think so much and just do it's all about action if you spend too much thinking about doing something then i don't know at least i have a tendency of not actually doing something if uh if i keep wondering i'm like oh what if or you know what if this other thing happens or you know what if i fall flip flop and crack my <laughs> i don't know where i'm going anyways i really enjoyed uh making this star it was kind of like Hmm, I don't really know what to do though. Maybe um, just a monster. I just kind of want to just the doodle and, and see where where the doodle goes. Um, as you guys probably already know, I don't like to um, edit that many mistakes. Or um, like if it's like at the beginning of the video, you probably just saw me scribbling a bunch of stuff and then just kind of like erasing it and just taking it from there. I, I don't know. It's just really, really fun. Um, I ended up being, or originally, I wanted to make um, a turtle. And then I was like, mm, no, let's make like a monster. I wanted to do something like a turtle monster where um, <clears throat> I wanted to put like a shield on their hand. Kind of like, um, I don't know, just like unstoppable kind of message in a doodle, if that's even possible. But, um, I just ended up going this route. I think it, it came out pretty cool. It was pretty fun. There's a lot of hidden images in this one. Um, there's one in particular uh, that I really like. It's at the very bottom. It's just like a little skull face. And he, he kind of looks like he has one of those, like, band uh, jackets or uniforms with the little like goading circle thing on a shoulder, like a shoulder pad maybe? Anyways, um, dang, I really have talked for like nine minutes already. Okay, the 10 minute mark is coming up and I still have to do the intro. So you guys take it easy. Remember, everyone needs to love. You need to love. You know what, forget everybody. Just you, you need to love your inner star because it's in there. Have fun, take it easy. Until next time, peace out.